Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel again. In this video, I explain how to change the password of the built-in administrator account, on the client computers at once, via PowerShell. I have previously explained a way to change the password of the administrator account, on the client computers using a script file. This method is very easy, fast and simple as well, and I will explain the steps in detail. First I will open one of the client computers. I will check the name of the computer and make sure that the computer is actually joined to the domain. After that, sign out from the computer to log in with the local administrator account and know the current password before changing it through the domain server. Look, this is the password for the built-in administrator account and each client computer may have a different password. So I will change it and unify the password for the built-in administrator account on each client computer. Then go to the domain server I will explain to you step by step how to change the password of the local administrator account on the client computers. First, open the PowerShell admin window. Then, enter the command that appears on the screen. This command will create a text file that contains all the names of the client computers that are joined to the domain. You can modify the text file path to any other path you want. You can also change the file name as you want. Once the command is executed, the text file will be created in the specified path. Open the file, you will find the names of all the client computers and also the domain computer name. Delete the domain computer name so that it is not changed while executing the command. You can also remove any computer for which you do not want to change the local administrator account password. Close the file and return to the PowerShell window to enter the second command. But before copying the second command, Make sure of the name of the text file and also make sure of the same file path so that the command is executed correctly. Also enter the new password that you want to apply to the client computers. After that, copy the command and paste it in the PowerShell window. Copy the command and paste it in PowerShell and wait for a few seconds to execute the command. You should receive a message that the command was successfully executed. A success message was received for only one computer. As for the other two computers, the command was not executed for them, because they are not available now. There should have been three messages remaining, then the local administrator account was successfully changed, but the other devices are not available, so they were shown in red. After that, go to the client computer, and log out of the local administrator account. We will check the login with the new password. Now enter the new password for the administrator account. The password for the built-in administrator account has already been changed. You can now change the password for all client computers easily. But the administrator account must have the same name on all client computers. I will leave you the commands in the video description. Thank you for watching. I hope the video is useful to you. I also hope you subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.